Have you experienced riding a fast moving vehicle like a bus or a car? How did you feel? How did the houses, the poles, trees, and other things appear as the vehicle you are riding passed by? Did they appear like they are the ones moving rather than the vehicle you are riding? What is the relationship between these situations and the laws of motion? This video clip will present to you Sir Isaac Newton's con contributions highlighting his law of motion. What is motion? Motion. Motion is the continuous rise of position of an object with respect to a reference point. It is typically described in terms of speed, speed, velocity, displacement, acceleration, and time. According to Isaac Newton, there are three laws of motion. Law of motion or the law of inertia. It states that an object at rest will stay at rest. will remain at rest or move at a constant speed in a straight line unless acted upon by an unbalanced force. Newton's second law of motion or the law of acceleration. It states that the net force of an object is equal to the product of its mass and acceleration. Examples are upon which the forces do not balance. The law states that unbalanced forces acted object to accelerate with an acceleration that is directly proportional to the net force and inversely proportional to the mass. Newton's third law of motion is the law of interaction. It states that for every action, there is an opposite reaction. Their forces always occur in pairs and happen at the same time. Examples are
I thank you. <laughs> tap your shoe, tap your shoe, brush your leg, crank it up, melee rock, side to side, we go block up. Kant's third law of states that for every action there is an equal and opposite reaction. The statement means in every action there is a pair of forces acting in two objects. Kaya gumawa na ako na para ano pa mabawi ang kalungkutan kaysa naman Lagi ka nagkakit